Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of both of Tom and Hillary, I'd like to thank you for attending this, the wedding celebration. You are indeed participating in one of the happiest moments of their lives. It's hard to believe it's been over or almost 10 years since he joined our sister Katie and I at UCF um, and he started his career as a doctor and fortunately he made it time for a little bit of fun while we were there because that's where Hillary comes into the picture. So we spent the last uh, 10 years or so watching them progress and then they really bring out the best in each other and they, they always look happy doing it. Tom and Hillary, about to take into your care and keep in the happiness of the one person you love the most. You two agreeing to share strengths, responsibilities, and love with one another. As husband and wife, you be each other's best friend, and each other's lover, and most of all, each other's protector. As much as I would love to tell you guys about an embarrassing story of glory days gone by, uh, the truth is that from day one when I met her at just barely 18, she was the poised, gracious, and intelligent woman that we all see before us today. I imagine that it was her striking grace that drew him to her as soon as they saw each other. Tom was a man who knew a good thing when he saw it. The two of them are beautiful souls whose journey of finding each other I have had the distinct pleasure to watch up close. I have no words of encouragement because I know so surely that they already know how to best love each other. The way that they care, support, and advocate for one another lets me know that they have everything that they will ever need in each other. All I can say is that it's been a pleasure to get to know two people so well suited for each other and get to watch them fall in love. This is a new beginning. the best part and Hillary this man whom you hold by the hand is to be your husband do you vow here as you've also promised to Tom they be true and loyal comforting and sorrow and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto him, so long as you both shall live. I do. Tom, this woman whom you hold by the hand is to be your wife. Do you vow here to be true and loyal, comforting and sorrow, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto her, so long as you both shall live. I do. I now pronounce them husband and wife. Tom, you may kiss your beautiful, smiling bride. <laughs>
believe you're finally here. I'm holding you today. No matter what the future holds, I have some things to say. Someday I'll lay my eyes upon the woman you'll become. It's only then I'll judge myself how well my work was done. So as I walked you down the aisle, so many things to say. But I had one thought for one last time. I'm holding you today. <laughs>